so I'm going to pull it toward me. And it's you, you get your fingers up against that to get yourself a little bit of uh, force because you want to just barely move it. Okay. And this side is still hitting first. So we can move it this move it back toward you. Yeah. And that you'd have to tweak for adjusting the time a little bit. Is that? Uh, or was no, it, you you move the bob oh, here for adjusting the time, time. Yep, okay. up and down. The uh, so that should be pretty much set. Yeah, should be. I've got marks here, uh, and they're probably hard to see. But yeah, I see. Uh, you know, I said it. This is where it uh, had the most accurate time here. Mm -hmm. But when we first started out, I had only on that top mark and as I saw that I needed to slow down the um, time mm -hmm. I moved the bob down okay. closer to the base here and so it's a good idea to make a mark to see where you came from okay it would be better to do it on the back but I couldn't quite get my head in my fingers so. be able to see right now <clears throat> already we've uh, thrown it off center just moving it, it around, around. Yeah. yeah so that needs to be yeah you can see how it's point. sort of shaking yeah so you're saying that you can hear it'll be an even yeah let's see if we can get it uh off just a little bit. And almost there. I may have tweaked it back in a little better yeah, than it was. A little better, so uh, they'll figure that out. Yeah. So. So that's your clutch right there. Yeah. going in you're holding this steady and mm -hmm. you're shifting that yeah a little bit either toward left or right yeah um i say if the finger is closer to the escapement uh wheel then you move the clutch more toward that direction toward that. Okay. yeah 